you guys welcome back to my channel um first of all i'm so sorry about my voice i am just getting over a cold so that's why i sound like this but anyways welcome back i know it's been a while since i made a video and so much stuff has happened um july was just a crazy month for me um well first of all i got married yay me and mr fernando are now married so we got married on July 3rd, and then um, after that, we went on our honeymoon two weeks after to Tokyo, Japan. But, um, so yeah, it's been a fun month, a um, very busy month, but nonetheless fun. But anyways, um, I bought quite a bit of stationery when I went to Japan, and I just wanted to share with you guys what I got um, at the Traveler's Factory. So I'm going to do... I can't talk. I'm going to do two videos. Um, one is going to be what I bought at the Traveler's Factory. And then the other one is just going to be um, like the random stationery I bought throughout my trip. But okay, let's get started. Okay, so I will show you guys what is in this bag. I'm going to put this to the side. I am seriously having the hardest time opening this beautiful package because it's so pretty and I don't want to open it. But I saved it um, for this video, so I'll open that at the end. So I bought this bag. It, everything didn't come in this bag, but I just put everything in it just for the video. But anyways, yeah, I bought this. Um, they sell this at the shop, and um, yeah, I thought it was really cute. So let me just dump all of this out. There we go. Oops. Um, so I know this question is going to come up a lot. I've had a lot of questions asking me um, how the prices were compared to uh, U.S. prices. Um, so basically, the traveler's notebooks, I think they're pretty much the same. Um, I bought this one for, I think it was $40.00. And I think the one I bought on Amazon, I think that was like $40. So I think it's pretty much the same um, here in the U.S. and in Japan for the notebooks. Um, as for the accessories, like um, like these, what's this called? The templates and um, like the brass ruler and the brass pen. Like basically all the accessories, it was pretty much um, half off. Um, at the store so like this was like I think this was like nine or ten dollars if I were to buy the brass ruler and like the template here um, I think they're like around 19 or 20 dollars here in the US so that was cool um, I've been wanting all this stuff for a really long time so I was very excited to purchase it at the actual store okay let's move all this aside so I'll start with the inserts that I bought um, I bought so I am going to start with the inserts that I bought um, so I got the um, I got number 13 we could probably get these here in the US but I don't know I haven't seen it at the store that I usually buy my inserts at here in Seattle um, this one is called lightweight paper and it's just blank but I don't know what kind of paper it is, but it's like super thin. It's like really thin. Um, yeah, it's just really thin. So I just wanted to try it out. The pen will probably bleed through, but I don't know. It has like 128 pages in here. So yeah, I just wanted to try this one out. Um, the second one I got was this i don't know this is like a turquoise color i've never seen um colored travelers notebook inserts so or at least ones by midori so i was excited when i saw these in the shop so i got um this turquoise one and this one is made out of craft paper uh let's see so this is what the inside looks like it is a lot thicker than the previous one that I just showed you guys. So yeah, I thought this was different. Um, and yeah, I wanted to try and purchase stuff that 
I can't really get here um, in the US so yeah it was different okay uh, next thing I got were where's my ruler were these two items um, it is a brass template and it has a little bookmark thingy right there and yeah I, I've been eyeing these for a really long time so thought I'd pick this up in the shop and then I also got the matching brass ruler as well um, I also got this brass ballpoint pen I have no idea if it writes well but I just thought it was so cute let me take it out for you guys Maybe I should probably try it. Um, so this is what it looks like. And, oh, it just pulls. You can just, oh, that's cute. So let me try it. Uh, let's get a notebook. So, yeah, it writes okay. I mean, probably not the best, but it's a really cute pen, and I thought it would look cute in my, um, in my, what's it called? Passport Traveler's Notebook. Okay, so that's that. And then I also got, um, this random binder clip looking thing I don't know why but I just thought it was cute and then next I got some washi I got the uh, let's see let me pull this out for you guys I got the Traveler's Factory washi just cuz I knew I couldn't get it anywhere else so yeah it just says Traveler's Factory and it has a cute little Midori on it and then I got, where's the, I can't find it, oh there it is, and then I got this washi, this one is not um, by Midori, but it's just a tools to live by uh, washi, but I just thought it was adorable, so I decided to get that too. Okay, and then, let's see, let's see, what else did I get, I got this brass tag. Um, to put on my notebook and let's see if I can zoom in for you guys Can you see that? Um, it says fly What's it say fly to the world from Japan travelers factory and then it also says made in Japan So I had to get that as a little souvenir from the shop Very excited about that. I thought that was so cute. Um, and then I got this actually this is not mine, but um my husband actually bought it for his keys it's a traveler's factory brass keychain which I'm kind of jealous I kind of want to take this from him so this is what it looks like it's like a keychain and then um, it's a brass keychain and then it comes with a lot of these little key rings and then it also has a leather traveler's factory um, little leather piece on it. Ooh, this is really cute. I want it. So, that is that. And then I just got a few little paper things from there just as souvenirs. So this one, these are postcards and I just thought they were really cute. Um, they're from the Traveler's Factory. So, yeah, that one just has a map. It says Traveler's Notebook. And then this one just has like various things about Japan. And then I got these. I don't know why. They're just stickers. I just thought they were super cute. It says Traveler's Factory on them. And then I also got this. What is this? I forgot. So it looks like a luggage tag. But it is. It's a notebook. Ooh. So they look like tags. But then on the other side, it's a notepad which is really cute. Ooh, I'm glad I got this. I didn't even know what it was. Okay, I'm finally gonna open this up, you guys. Oh, this pains me. I really don't want to open this because it's so beautiful. So, funny story. So, they do um, free gift wrap at the Traveler's Factory. And 
I just bought a notebook for myself and I saw that it said like free gift wrap. So I was like, why not? And then it like came with this like super cute like leather tag and this thing and the cute sticker. So I'm really glad that I asked for it to be wrapped. But anyways, oh, it's so pretty. No, okay, I'm over it. Let's open this baby up. So this is what it looks like. I mean, I'm sure if you're watching this that you are a Traveler's Notebook fan. So you've probably seen what this looks like anyways. But the one I got is the, I think it's the newest color. Um, it is the Camel Color Majority Traveler's Notebook. And, oh my gosh, it's so pretty. And this is what it looks like. Ta-da! Oh, it's so pretty. And it comes with just the regular insert inside. And then it also comes with this um, little extra elastic band. So that is what I got from the Traveler's Factory in Tokyo. Um, I also wanted to show you guys one more thing. I I didn't buy this from the Traveler's Factory. I actually got it in a different stationery shop um, in Tokyo, but I wasn't sure if they were gonna have them at the Traveler's Factory, so I just bought it before I actually went to um, the shop. So anyways, I bought this and it comes in a little mini tin. You guys, look how cute this is. It's like so freaking adorable. Oh my gosh. And it's an even tinier than the mini passport size um, traveler's notebook. Like how cute is this thing? And then what is this? It comes with like a little tiny charm. See if I can get that up close for you guys. And then, I am not sure what this is. Oh my goodness. Are these? Oops. I don't know what these are. Are they like little inserts? I have no idea what that is. But okay, let's open this up. This is so adorable. It comes exactly how the bigger one is packaged. This is so cute. Holy crap. Okay. Oh my gosh. This is so adorable, you guys. It's so tiny. Why is it so cute? Oh my goodness. How adorable is this? It's, oh my gosh. It's so tiny. Ah, it's so cute. Okay, so yeah, these are the little inserts. I will put that in later. But anyways, I have to... Okay, I just have to compare this because it's so small. <gasps> this is so cute! I can't get over it. Okay, anyways, that is my Midori Travelers... No, or Midori Travelers shop haul. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Um, I'm going to upload like a vlog of my entire honeymoon trip and then maybe later I'll even upload like a vlog type or not vlog, a video, video of my wedding when that comes out. So just to share with you guys. But anyways, I hope you guys like my haul. Thank you guys for watching and I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye.